Hello, I'm Drawing Pin, and welcome to our Let's Play of Motorsport Manager, where we are in the GT Challenger series with our own creator team, Pinwheel Racing. And in the last episode, we were in Beijing, right? Yeah, Beijing, and I think uh, Lahane was like ninth, and I think you were like 14th, I think it was. Uh, helped out by a safety car. Uh, we managed to pit under the safety car, and uh, especially Lahane really, really helped him out there. And uh, so we managed to bag a nice set of points again. And we're doing all right in the team championship, actually. We managed to jump up to seventh. It's really close here between uh, eighth and down to, up to fifth. There's not a lot, you know, there's less than 10 points in it. So, uh, you know, we could finish anywhere here. I think we're pretty safe in the bottom two. Kind of wish I'd said eighth now, which would have given us a bit more cash at the start. But uh, anyway, we went with that. Uh, I mean, if we can get fifth, great. But eighth is wherever we can get, really. Eighth to fifth, one of those two is absolutely fine. The more, the higher up we go, the more money we get. So, uh, you know, obviously we want to finish, well, we want to finish first, really. But, uh, you know, we want to, we want to finish fifth uh, if we can. But, uh, you know, if we can get seventh or eighth, I'll be pleased with that. So that's good. Right, let's jump into the mail and we'll check out the news, which I think we haven't had a mistake yet. No, we've still been mistake free. That's uh, really good. Let's take the interview. Uh, Lorenzo Ferrari is climbing your brakes hole on his back. I mean, he needs to button it, but he's not wrong. But he needs to button it and shut up about his brakes because uh, we have got some, but we haven't actually built them yet or we haven't actually uh, worked on them. Claudia Dreyfus, scanner report. Let's go and check her out. I'm pretty sure she's not bad. I think it's her. Yeah, marketing kind of sucks. Um, yeah, she ain't got much room to improve, but it's pretty slow. She's not great. She's considering offers. Fair enough. Um, I'd say no. Your marketing's terrible. Let's come over to the pit crew. Uh, well, we'll swap out a few of them. Uh, you definitely need to be swapped out. Have we got anybody that could do that? Uh, I, don't know, I really. Oh, we're gonna have to buy some more pit crew. Let's just do it. And uh, oof, ah, oh, shame on the tyres, but oh, and the shame there. Oh, that's a, that's a shame. I mean, that. Wow, look at that. Oof, that's. Oh, that is good. That is tempting. He could do the front and the rear jack. He can kind of take over from that. Um, uh, let's get rid of you because you have a mistake chance and so do you. That means they're under 90, although uh, 89. They're, uh, you know, around 90 plus uh, when they've got 0% on the mistake chance. I kind of like this guy, but I'd like someone that could do tyres, which he can, but he can do fixing as well. Do you know what? This guy's not bad. His roof feels terrible, but he can kind of fit most of the roles, so... Yeah, I think we'll get you in. Let's go for it. Let's do it. I think he's pretty good. Let's get him in there. So, uh, tyres and fixing will go... We will definitely go with you. We might as well. And then fixing and tyres. Do we have anybody? Hmm. Not really got anybody, have we? Uh, hmm. Yeah, that, we're starting to run out of uh, starting to run out of people now. That's uh, that's okay. Oh, well, let's just um, what are you like? Yeah, you're full. Let's just put some of these people in for now. We'll, we need to build the pit crew up, but uh, for now we we just we'll just deal with what we've got. Um, there we go. That is really good. Also, um, I think everybody else is okay. The jack man, the front and rear jacks could do with being a swap being swapped out. We could do the rear jack first. Uh, I know that's really going to bring us down, but let's do that and just rest him up a little bit. That's okay. You need to be rested as well. Do we have anybody that could do the front jack? Actually, you're better than the front jack than the guy that's sitting in there at the moment. So, yeah, definitely. Let's do that. There we go. Not a great crew, but uh, still six on the grid. So, wow, yeah. Got a pretty decent uh, pit crew. Right, so let's move on and we will uh, get to the car repair. Although I think we were just working on the gearboxes, but uh, we'll go there and have a look. Right, there we go. The car repair is finished and the suspension is also finished as well. So uh, that's really good. So let's come over here and we're going to do another set of suspensions straight away. Uh, we'll go that and then... Uh, that's reliability. I'm kind of tempted to go random component, maybe. Mm. I mean, that's not bad, actually, for the weight stripping. That would be pretty cool. If we get that. The other two, less good, but uh, it is kind of random, so... <sighs> um, do we go with that? They get built really quick. But to be honest, we could just go with the guaranteed 25. I think we're going to go with the random. I like that. Let's do it. It's cheaper. We have a chance of getting something good. So we've got a 
crap ton of parts now. Um, we just got to work on them, and I think that's all we can really do is just work on them. So I'll work on those gear boxes. They're not going to be done till after the race, but uh, hopefully they'll be ready to use because we could really do with using those. And I think we'll get uh, we got two yeah we got two sets of brakes, we got two sets of suspension. So I think we will probably look at start making some uh, like an illegal gearbox or something as well, and then we'll leave those because uh, you know we don't want to make too many parts and then not be able to use them. So I think that's what we'll do there is we'll make up and we'll make that set of suspension, and then we'll probably start thinking about maybe an illegal gearbox. Um, we'll stockpile a few parts, and then we just won't design anything else. And we'll just work on the parts we've built uh, for the rest of the year. I think that's the way we're going to go with that because we're building these really quick. Uh, so that's good. Right, so let's move it on until the suspension or a dilemma or something comes in, I guess. So uh, let's move it on. Okay, so here we go. The suspension has been built and we got the minus 20 to max plus 40. So eh, that wasn't that great. But oh well, as I say, it's the gamble. So, uh, you know, you you sometimes you get something good sometimes you get something bad we seem to have had that quite a few times so oh well let's come over here and we'll check the car out we're not going to do anything with that suspension right now but i think we are oh, but let's just check the engine i don't think there's anything really good reliable uh illegal yeah there's nothing really good here um we can get that but wow we could go four um there's nothing really that adds top speed though is there i mean like that and you could go that but there's nothing mm, yeah no we're not gonna do it. i think engines about as good as we're gonna get a uh, gearbox though we could make a really sweet gearbox like that that and that we could make that 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 would be good um what do we go with the random component take the chance that we get something really good or we get something terrible we could take a gamble I think we're going to go with the gamble. Or oh, is that? I do quite like that. It's just guaranteed, isn't it? Yeah, it's totally random as to what you get. So you know, we could have just get we could get that um, what we just had last time, which isn't that great. Or we could get something. You know, we could get plus sixty or something like that. It's total gamble. So I think I'm just going to go with the guaranteed thirty-five on that one. Let's do it. Although that does reduce the time in the car. And it's only 100k. Let's do it. Let's go there. That's fine. That's going to be a really nice sweet gearbox. Uh, it's going to take a long time to build. But that's fine. So we've got two sets of brakes. Two sets of suspension. And uh, we've got three engines. And we're going to get a third gearbox. So we're all good there. So really we just need to now focus on getting these up to speed. And uh, being able to use them. Oh we've got a scatter report. Let's go and check. Stephenson. Um pretty good not bad yeah damn you're 17 you look like you're about 35 but okay <laughs> um improvement rates not bad uh but i don't think we're going to be our wonder kids smooth breaker first lap hero pretty decent it's going to be expensive we'll throw a favorite on you but you're going to be really expensive i like the stats you've got five star potential so we don't have to actually uh we wouldn't have to actually uh, recruit anybody else. Remarkability is not brilliant, but it's not terrible at the same time. He's at least got some chances to get some buffs while we uh, work on our marketability. So, yeah, I'll throw a favour on you. I'm probably not going to offer you one because you'll be really expensive. But, uh, you know, one for the future maybe. So, uh, yeah. Right, let's move it on and we'll get to the race now, I think. Okay, so here we are. We've got a GMA vote and we've got a, we'll go and check the scouting report first quickly. But, oh boy, no. Just interest. Wow, look at that. Damn, that is good improve. That's decent improvement rate. It's not amazing, but that is good. Uh, shame you suck and have got, uh, yeah, no no discernible talent whatsoever. But anyway, never mind. Right, let's come over here. What are we actually voting on? 60 mile an hour pit, limit, pit lane speed limit. Hmm, I don't think I really care about that. I'm not sure exactly what it is at the moment, to be honest. But, uh uh, this room will benefit progressive teams. This one will not. So it doesn't say it's good. I'm just going to abstain. Let's do that. Um, yeah, it just means they are faster. They come down the pit lane a bit quicker. Oh, it got rejected. Okay. A lot of people seem to care about that one way or the other. But, oh, wow, they used two vote power. Damn. They really didn't want it. Okay. 
Well, that's fine. Uh, so what have we actually got? Just out of curiosity now, what have we actually got? Uh, pit lane speeds, yeah, it's normally 40. So it means they come down a bit quicker and uh, I guess the pit stops will be a little faster as well. Uh, maybe a bit more chance for things to go wrong, I guess. So uh, either way, I'm not really bothered about that. If that gets voted in or not, it doesn't really bother me. So, uh, you know, might as well keep the voting power. So uh, let's roll it again and uh, we'll get to the race or the next dilemma or something. Right, so here we go. We're just about ready now to go off to Milan. And uh, I just noticed this. Uh, he's a club goer, so he gets plus five to the marketability for 19 weeks. So that's really good. And we've got a couple of scatter reports. So we may as well go and check them out as well. Um, I mean, not bad. Uh, marketing's terrible and uh, no real room for improvement. But not bad. You know, decent average driver for this kind of tier. She's not a bad uh, driver, but... Marketing is just awful, so uh, I'd say no to you. Let's go and check you out. Passive, young gun. Um, oh, wow, look at that improvement rate. Now, damn, that's a decent improvement rate, but you've not really got any more room to improve. That's a shame. Um, but, yeah, you're pretty decent. Marketing's okay, but it's not very good, to be honest. I'm kind of looking more like 70% plus, really. So I'd say no with you as well. So, uh, yeah, let's, that's a shame. But uh, let's come over here now, and we're going to select Golden Tiger. We're going to go... Do we have any parts to fit? Um, are those gearboxes ready? Yes, they are. Right. Let's go gearboxes there. You're unhappy, really, dude? You're the reserve driver. What do I care about? You're, yeah, you're like a reserve driver, so, you know, you're not even supposed to be that... Uh, you're not even supposed to be driving the car. You know, you're hired in as a reserve, so... Uh, you know, that's fine. But uh, 91, that's good enough. We can strip out a bit of weight off those as well. So that's good. And uh, let's just check that out. They're probably done, yeah, six days after the race. So we can get those done, and then we'll start working on the brakes next. And then we'll get the suspension finished, and uh, then we'll get all the work on the performance of all those parts. And then hopefully we can work on that gearbox. I don't think we're going to make too many more parts uh, for the moment, but uh, we might make some it, it, by uh, sort of like China again. So we gave China twice. Interesting. Uh, we might, you know, by the time we go to Beijing, we might make a set of breaks if we've uh, got through these parts. But I kind of want to improve them first. Uh, you know, no point having a pile of parts that you haven't improved. So uh, there's that. Right. So that's good. And uh, what are we? Oh, it's the little tiny track as well. Okay. Interesting. Low wear, high burn. And it's going to be quite warm in the qualifying and practice, but the race is going to be quite uh, quite cool. Interesting. It's this little ditty track. Fair enough. Right, so I shall go off now and uh, do some practicing, and I'll see you all back for Q1. Now, welcome back to Q1 in Milan, where it is nice and dry. The qualify, uh, the practice, sorry, was quite as uh, dry as well, so that's good. And it looks like it's going to be dry for the first couple of minutes, but past that we can't see. Uh, I managed to get level three with both the race trim and the medium tire I went for. That's the harder of the two compounds. Uh, the qualifying, we're just we're just not able to really do much in it. Uh, soft tires and that, we just don't have the time or. Uh, there's only like 12 minutes to set the cars up and then you know Lahane's uh, feedback is terrible so uh, it's really kind of letting the side down but uh, we'll go with that we got like uh, I think 97s uh, oh hang on what did you no sorry which one was it you you were 98 uh, it was uh, Lahane I think was the uh, 98 as well okay managed to uh, just get that just tweaked it a little bit at the end there to try and get a couple of extra percent and uh, just managed to do it so that's good but I didn't actually see it uh, let's take some weight out of these cars. Uh, we're going to take, go to like 85, and then we'll take, go there, I think. I don't want to take too much out, but I think that's fine. Uh, gets us a little bit of performance, not a lot, but a little bit. That's fine. Um, yeah, we can't do the suspensions and brakes yet. That's all good, though. Uh, so that's good. So they got a nice little uh, performance boost. So let's get on to Q1 and uh, get to it. We're just going to go straight out again because, uh, you know, it's dry at the moment. Uh, but who knows what it's going to be doing in a few minutes' time. So let's get you out. Let's get you out next. Go times 12. Uh, times 12. There we are. Thank you. Let them set the cars up. And let's watch Farah. I think Lahane's probably going to be the one who's got a better car. So, yeah. Starting their flying lap. We've got purples at the moment. But obviously that's going to, yeah, as soon as... Uh, these guys start uh, putting their times in. We're not going to be purples for long. But there we go. Lahane's probably going to win. Yeah, 
he has got the better car this is a bit more of a speed circuit there we go that's uh, kind of crushed us 1.3 1.6 behind so that's kind of what I figured though and then we're gonna sit here looks like it's gonna be dry gonna sit here for about the two we could it's short laps isn't it? it's only a minute per lap we might be able to get three runs but I know that it's worth it to be honest I really want that to sponsor target so I guess it is yeah we're gonna try and get it I think Lahane might be able to do three runs I don't know if uh, Farah can do it but uh, we've got the tires we're not probably not going to use much in the way of soft tires so uh, there we go let's risk it it's going to be close but I think we might just be able to get three runs it's going to be tight I don't think Farah can do it I think Lahane might be able to do it we are bottom at the moment as well so that's not good and he's not improving either uh, Farah's improved in the middle sector so that's something but yeah okay yeah I, d I don't know whether you're actually going to be able to get out again it's going to be tight I don't think no I don't think you're going to do it oh well that's a shame yeah out out in Q1 and we are last stone dead last yeah there's no point going out didn't think we had enough time but it was worth the risk oh well let's just accelerate the time now because uh, yeah that, that's a disastrous qualifying start that is terrible out stone dead last okay that is not good right well a lot to make up for in the uh, race then welcome to Milan on race day where it is nice and dry at the moment we have propping up that nice back of the grid uh, which is less good but uh, it's going to be dry up till lap 8 uh, we've probably got quite a lot of laps here actually I think it's like 30 some odd laps or something isn't it so it's a short circuit so uh, yeah we've got like 26 laps we're going to switch on yeah 32 laps so we're going to leave the uh, fuel in we're going to put these on I don't think uh, I don't think Lahane could uh, Lahane might what's the temperature 16 he might be able to do a one stop but I don't think so so you're definitely going to probably do two uh, a couple of runs on these mediums and then probably switch over to the soft for the last run and that's probably what Lahane's going to do as well um I think that's what we're going to go with he could just do it i wonder if we start you on the soft tire and change it up a bit i'm kind of tempted to do that yeah let's do that let's switch the split up the strategies i think that's what we're going to go with you go on the soft tire first and then medium and then maybe back to soft let's go attack and we're going to go overtake straight away both drivers so yeah they're kind of splitting the strategies so uh, he's going to go long in the first stint you're going to go a bit shorter and then uh, maybe put you onto the softs for the second two stints. We'll see. We'll see how the soft and the medium go. But uh, let's get out there anyway. And uh, wow. Oh, oh yes. Uh, they're uh, qualifying. Uh, the second session was uh, wet. So uh, they're locked into those tyres. But then I don't think they're actually locked into them. Because um, they uh, they used Inter. So uh, yeah. They uh, get a, get to uh, they get their tyres. But they're all uh, you know fully intact. So yeah right here we go let's get ready to go we'll watch the hang because he is probably the better driver he's the better driver and has the better car so let's uh, go but this is a very much a speed circuit you know there's basically two long straights and a couple of corners there's not really a lot so it's almost a it's almost an oval so uh, you know speed is well I mean speed cornering breakings is not really any of our strong suits of our car or to be honest our drivers so um, yeah not not great all round really let's hit some boost now and then we're going to go with the Hain and let him boost and we're just going to unload the boot whoa whoa Farrah oh my god dude now that's more like it that's what I want to see that's what I wanted to see wow okay nice one dude is there this guy say I'm kind of keep to keep this guy in the driver's seat for another season to be honest I know he's not great but at the moment he's paying paying well so uh, let's drop down now because we don't want to chew up these tyres too much. Uh, maybe just keep pushing a little bit with you. Go like high and push for a lap, I think, with both of them. Uh, no, go push. Yeah, Lahane's kind of uh, fighting his way back up the field again. 
Uh, so, okay, I didn't actually notice, but well, I mean, the top 10 went on soft anyway, and then uh, it's kind of a split, I think, most. Uh, kind of just a few extras on the mediums, but uh, yeah, there's a few people got on the softs as well that have started where we did, so I guess that's something. Uh, we'll kind of hang on to that for a bit. Uh, let's uh, back off now. Uh, maybe keep the engine on high, actually. Keep the engine on high. I think that's something we want to do. Uh, we'll just keep an eye on it, but I think we're okay. Uh, just to try and get, get over that speed deficit that we've got a little bit. Uh, Farrah is stone dead last, so that's not so good. But uh, what were the lap times? 102.4 and a 102.0, so... Yeah, oh wow, Only I was about to say, you're in the 59.9s, but everyone else is doing a minute, minute one, a few minute twos. So, yeah, I'd say this probably not going to suit us, this track. It's very quick. And, uh, yeah, there's you know there's not really many in the way of corners either. So, yeah, not going to suit us very well. But, uh, you know, we need, we need a better car and, you know, we need some better drivers as well, really. So, uh, this is fine though, but I uh, really want that sponsor target. We missed out on it in qualifying. I really want that sponsor target. That's my goal, is to get that 13th spot. Struggling to overtake Silvera. No, I think uh, they just overtaken you. Damn, Farah, are you... Wow. Damn, dude, you are... <sighs> yeah, I don't think the medium tyre is working well at all for you, is it? Okay, let's... Uh... We're going to push, we're going to attack, and we're going to go overtake, and you're going to come in next lap. Damn, yeah, we are not doing well at all here. This is not suiting out of track at all. This does not suit us, this track. Right, let's boost, see if we can get back and get Come on, steer around them. Uh, we're going to go mediums. Uh, we're going to leave the fuel. We'll drop an extra lap of fuel in. Yeah, let's drop a couple of laps of fuel in, see if we can get quite a distance with you. That's kind of what I want. And then we'll go back onto the soft tyre, or maybe even the medium tyre. Uh, meanwhile, you just keep doing what you're doing. Uh, we'll keep an eye on that tyre. It's getting close to going off the cliff, but I think we'll be okay with it. It's going to be tight. It's going to go off at 10. Yeah, we're just in. There we go. Just made it. Perfect. Right. Yeah, there's a bunch of people already in the pits as well. So, yeah, you boost now. I think you do another lap after this, and then uh, we'll uh, get you to come in. But uh, you go for a bit longer. Yeah, do one more lap, I think. There we go. Let's bring you in now. You can really push it. Uh, I think you just keep pushing and switch it down to high because uh, we're at about the car there. Yeah, let's bring you in. Um, what do we do? I think we're going to go medium again. We're going to go medium again. Uh, we're going to put a lap of fuel in it. There we go. That's fine. And you just keep pushing. Go to push now. It's all good. In he comes. There we go. Yeah, he's still got a bit of few tyres left, but uh, that's okay. Right, so we're 18th. That's not good. See if we can boost past you. No, not really. Wow, we are not doing well on this track at all, are we? Let's settle in for the long haul with you. And uh, yeah, they, they're first are going to lap us soon. I mean, there's just no question about that. They are going to lap us. You know, they've stopped and they're there. They're, I mean, they're going to they're going to lap us. There's just no question in that. So we're going to start losing that big time once that happens. But uh, we're up to 15th and 17th, so that's okay. Uh, we'll let Farrah push a little bit longer. Probably switch that down now. Let go push. And high on the engine. But uh, yeah, first is going to be rapidly catching us. 107, I suspect, once they actually get around and clock in a lap time, uh, they'll probably uh, get that. Wow, what happened there? Oh, really? Come on came out and we hit the brakes that annoys me drive around him man drive around him okay yeah you're pushing but that's kind of why you're pushing and got high engine modes right that's fine so we're going to get Farah to go and we'll get Lahane to go as well there we go yeah I think the uh, boost that um, charges up faster is the one we're going to go with uh, okay those have pit, those people have made a pit stop so we're not that far behind actually being lapped 
so that's not so bad right let's just keep going now and we'll keep it keep it keep on on and 17 laps to go so we really want to get to like lap 20 23 24 something like that i think uh to think about putting the soft tire on and going again but um yeah we'll just we'll just stick at this oh hello i did not notice is someone pitted yes yeah, someone's pitted so that's good uh, that's the Nicholas and uh, the, was it Mega that we were racing? Yeah, those are the ones we were at the bottom. And then we we're racing uh, these brown Orleans. And that's so, uh, yeah, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. We're not doing great. But uh, I'd say this track just does not suit us, I don't think. Um, yeah, much more to say about that than that. It just doesn't seem to suit our car very much. Um, so you're probably going to get try and get seven laps if we can out of you, and then just go crazy with the uh, super, uh, go crazy with the soft tire at the end and really push it. I think that's our plan. Um, I really like that sponsor money, to be perfectly honest. But uh, that, that's the goal. But we are we're not that far behind actually. Okay, yeah, we are now. Uh, we're like two seconds off thirteenth, uh, so and slowly falling behind. Oh wow, look at that, flown past. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that uh, one that charges up really quick. Um, I think that's the one to go for us, I think. I think you may go mediums again. We'll see. Uh, let's do a boost though. Both drivers get boost on. There we are. So it doesn't hold as much charge, but uh, it charges up really quickly. And then there's this one that's kind of in the middle ground. And then I think the other one, if I remember rightly, I didn't like that one at all. It hardly charged up, so it wasn't very good. But we'll have a look when we get to design the car chassis, uh, what the actual options are. So we've just got someone who's gone in the pits. But uh, we're going to be thinking about pit stops soon, but we'll try and get another couple of laps. Uh, Lahane is actually really... Uh, yeah, he came in first, didn't he, of course. Uh, oh! Ah, damn, Engelhardt's crashed, but no safety car, that's a shame. That's a shame. Okay, let's get uh, Lahane to really push it now. And he's going to come in, I think. Right. Fuel. We're going to get uh, that amount of fuel. And we're going to go back onto that, I think. I think that's the tyre to go for. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's not much quicker than that one, to be perfectly honest. But I think we're going to go with the soft tyre. There we go. That all looks good. Right, in you come. And then uh, Farah's going to push it in the next lap and come in. And probably do the same. Oh, someone's getting a part fixed. Please be like fixing the engine and gearboxes and everything. That would be really nice. That would be really good. Okay. Uh, so you come in now as well. I don't know whether you can make that last. It's right on the bubble. Um, I think you're going to go medium again. Kind of sceptical as whether you can make that last. But he's got really good... Oh, really? Okay, we haven't got enough fuel. Seriously? Told me nine laps. Okay, now nine laps are remaining. Okay. Right, well, yeah, you kind of lied to me on that one then, game. Oh, well, we're going to have to turn that down then. That's a shame. Uh, so we can't really push much more than that. We're going to have to go there with it. Uh, we'll keep pushing with the car. And you push. How's the car looking, speaking of which? Not bad. Yeah, look, looks pretty good. We can probably keep this going for a bit longer. Uh, let's go to push now. Um, get uh, Farah to uh, do a little uh, yeah people are coming in the pits this is good this is good okay let's get him to boost there we are we're in our sponsor target this is what I want okay drop down now we keep pushing uh, we're going to have to think about doing some fuel saving at some point and turn the engine down but I think we might just be okay let's go there with it I think we're probably just okay but we may just need to go down a little touch um, and just save some fuel yeah we're gonna have to we haven't got enough fuel in this thing 
that is a shame yeah it told me nine laps and yeah that's uh that's not what we've got so let's boost we're almost there but not quite I think he needs to switch down a little bit as well if you keep pushing we're getting there we're almost in there I think if we just keep it on this on this low setting we should be okay we can flick it back up to medium um, hopefully he can really push it and just uh, there we go excess fuel it's fine switch it back up again got four laps to go um, I mean they might lap us actually kind of more concerned about him at the moment um, oof okay I'm going to have to stop push in no 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 damn it damn it damn 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 yeah I think we might get lapped yeah la uh, car 1 is right behind us they might lap us damn 58 0 holy moly that is a fast time yeah car 1 is right behind us they're coming up on Farah he's probably going to get get blue flagged there we go. That's the that's the blue flag for you. You get screwed over on this in this game. Uh, brakes feel a little spongy. Okay. Well, that is a shame. Oh, they're getting parts fixed and stuff, but that's a that's a real. Oof. Uh, no, we're probably gonna have to still do two laps, aren't we? Just depends. If they overtake us this lap, we're on the final lap. If they don't, then we've got another lap to go. Oh. Yes, someone came in for a pit. Ah, there we go. Yeah, we're on the final lap. Let's go. Let's go then. We're on the final lap. Let's just boost like a madman now. So we've managed to do it. 13th and 14th. That's good. So we should finish. There we go. Yes! Hit that sponsor target. That's all I really care about, to be honest. Um, is hitting that sponsor target. Shame we missed out uh, on the qualifying. That was a that was a pretty tough race for us. That was not good. Um, car did not perform very well there, but uh, you know it'll get better. But um, at the moment that wasn't a good, that wasn't a great uh, performance for us. But uh, I, to be honest, wasn't too bad. Um, you know could have been better, but it could have been a whole lot worse. We could have finished uh, stone dead last like we qualified stone dead last. Right, so here we are, results time, 13th and 14th, and wow, you got demoted two places for a part, and you got 10 second time penalty as well. Wow, Sally Higgins was really uh, racking up the penalties that time, and uh, yeah, Engelhart crashed out, but uh, other than that, that wasn't too bad. Where did Magar, Nicholas, Magar, Nicholas, they did okay, but um, yeah, you know, we, beat, we managed to beat Magar anyway, so uh, yeah, I think Marshall was the other one, and... I think it was like Orleans AMR was another one that we were racing in the third in that sort of mid tier but yeah we didn't do great there but uh, you know it wasn't too bad and uh, yeah you've dropped down a spot and uh, you've gone up a little bit more so that's good and there we are we're still yeah Marshall we just managed to maintain that uh, spot of uh, 86 points and uh, just managed to get that seventh spot so that's good and yeah, as I say, there's not a lot in it. There's four points. I mean, those two are tied on 90. Uh, so you could jump up to fifth. And there's not much behind there. We're only three points ahead of Marshall. So yeah, I think Yuma was uh, Falco, uh, Falco Engelhart's team as well. So they didn't score very well at all. So uh, yeah, we're looking good here for, I think, an eighth finish at least. But, you know, we could get fifth, which would be phenomenal for our first season and would be a really nice paycheck. So that's all good. Right, so here we go. Stack gains for Farah again. As I say, these don't seem that high. I feel like they should be higher than that. But to be honest, I can't remember what his base was. But that doesn't seem very good for someone that should be getting times two. But anyway, whatever. And uh, light footed on the super soft tyres. Oh, okay, that's good. Well, that'd be really good, actually, because he's got really good smoothness. And then coupled with that, that could be really good. Uh, that could be really powerful if we uh, get to use the super softs uh, when we get to use them. That could be a really good trait. So we uh, may use that one, actually. Uh, chairman's obviously all happy. And uh, we got another 1.3 on the marketing. So that's even better. And, of course, we hit a sponsor target on one end. So, uh, you know, we didn't make a lot of money, but uh, we didn't lose money. So uh, I, guess that's a, I guess that's a positive. 
Right, well, there we are. We're just halfway through the season now. That was race five. So, you know, that, that wasn't bad. I think 13th and 14th, that's kind of our aim, to be honest. Um, if we can get higher up, that's all the better. But 13th and 14th, I think, is kind of our aim. And we, if we can hit that sponsor target and keep getting the 100, 200k of race, that's just really going to help us out. Because, uh, yeah, money's not looking great. And we really need to get some uh, fact get like a new factory uh, i'd really like that before the end of the season but that's just not going to happen um you know so uh, there's that but uh, and you know design centers and all the rest of it would be really nice to get in but um that uh, that factory i think is the first ones we get more slots open for parts performance and uh, reliability things uh, so that's all good but uh, yeah i think this is where i'm going to call it and end the episode so if you like that one please give me a thumbs up comment your thoughts down below subscribe for more i really do appreciate it stay safe out there everyone and i'll catch you next time